Hey everyone, today I'm going to be checking out Someday's Bakery here in Astoria, Queens, right on the corner of 30th Avenue and Crescent Street. This bakery has been getting rave reviews as of late. The head baker used to be part of La Bray, which is a famous bakery in the East Village of Manhattan. Mount Sinai Hospital of Queens is right on the corner. Not a very large place, there's already a line forming outside. Let me tell you, it smells heavenly in here. They're really known for their croissants. And then they got the uh, chocolate and pistachio croissants there. Wow. I don't know what to get now. Let me get an almond croissant and a sesame croissant. So seven bucks for the almond and eight bucks for the black sesame. $16.23 after tax. Not cheap by any means for two pastries. This looks fantastic. Man, does this smell amazing. Whoa! And it just spilled out all over the table, just like I wanted to. But at least I got a good thumbnail. All right, let me break open this box. All right, we got black sesame croissant and the almond. I think I'll go for the almond croissant first. Man, this thing is so flaky and warm. I think it's impossible not to get your hands dirty here. This is enough for lunch already, just some pastries. Seven bucks for this. OMG. This is hands down the best almond croissant I've ever had. Take a look at this paste just coming out of it. Mmm. Man. Just oozing with goodness. Buttery, flaky, crispy. Anything you'd ever want a croissant. It's right here. Mm. Man. And you got that powdered sugar too. This is a masterpiece of a croissant. And I can see why people rave about this place. It's really, really good.
To be honest, it's like eating candy. It's that good. It's sweet, but in a good way. I would say um, my favorite part about this croissant is just the the crust. It's just like falls apart when you bite into it. The crunch, just the amount of like everything in here, man. That this filling too. Place as something else. Wow, those uh, almonds are amazing too. Mm. Absolutely the best almond croissant I've ever had. And my neighbors here eating agree with me too. I have never been to a place where like the filling is like overflowing and it's just like so warm and satisfying to eat. I can't believe it. Mm. I don't think I've ever been happier eating a bakery item than this almond croissant. <laughs> I devoured as you can see. But now it's time for the black sesame chocolate croissant. Man, they have even the layers of the black sesame on this. It's like perfectly done. And then they have some chocolate stripes here too. And some kind of filling in here. We got to have this. Oh man. Oh. Let me tell you, they fill this thing up. It is filled with chocolate, sesame, same flaky crust that I love from the almond croissant. Just transferred over here. Mmm. Oh man. I think this might be in contention for like New York City's best bakery. I definitely know there's the best bakery in the neighborhood, hands down. also in a small space too so I don't know how they make it work but man this is unbelievable so much like black sesame flavor just like hits you straight up as soon as you bite it you got that same like filling from the almond croissant also and tons and tons of chocolate too you cannot miss this bakery folks mmm Oh man. I'm gonna need to go on a diet for a month after eating this. <laughs> it's 
seriously. <laughs> If I do have to say something about this place, um, no seating inside. Um, you're not going to be able to wash your hands pretty easily here, so I guess I'm going to have to deal with sticky hands for a while. But <laughs> these bakery items are darn good. I'd recommend you to just get those items and bring them somewhere where you have um, easy access to a restroom because. No doubt about it, even with wrapping paper or napkins, you're going to get your hands dirty. Mm. Now for my ranking. Now, seven, eight bucks for a croissant, definitely pricey, not going to lie. Inflation is hitting hard, but I would say since these are the best croissants I've ever had, I think the price is justified actually. Just don't expect me eating this all the time because I already said I'm going to need to be on a diet for a month, but it is darn good. And if you want to treat yourself to something or bring this over to a party or something, your friends are going to love it. And for that, it's getting... Two thumbs up for me.